What's going on everyone? I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to another video. For some reason, oh, it's raining, it's amazing. For some reason, I recorded this video mostly in the wrong orientation. My apologies, it's, uh, I realized it's because I normally use that tripod and or that whole setup to take skipping videos, uh, which I post to my Instagram. They look like this. There we go. And um, yeah, so for some reason I, I don't know why I didn't change it because YouTube is the opposite to Instagram and um, just apologizing I hope you guys are still gonna enjoy the video and uh, yeah it's gonna be the same it's just slightly smaller but uh, yeah enjoy cool it's the same day I just thought I'd talk about consistency so how do you stay consistent I think a big thing is one remembering why you started and uh, two keeping that the end goal somewhere in your way so that you every time you're doing something that's difficult for you you know that's the reason it's yeah it links to number one remembering why you started another way to stay consistent is to do whatever you're doing with someone else because life is always better together so yeah try get a partner it could be a gym partner it could be a study partner it could be anything and it, it doesn't mean you have to do or whatever it is you're doing all the time together but um it could be like once or twice a week where you just get together with that friend and it just makes things so much better so yeah like you see michael and i we work out together twice a week and that's a lot of fun but we also work out separately than the other three days of the week or however many days we work out if you give yourself small goals to achieve along the way it's much easier than having to try do one gigantic task. So um, yeah, just make small milestones and celebrate your victories. It doesn't matter how small the victory, if you did, I'm just gonna use working out for example, if you did 10 minutes today, then celebrate that. And yeah, I'm here by our fire. We're gonna bright tonight. It's a little bit random, but um, I saw it there. So that's what I'll tell you guys. That's a nice way to celebrate with your family. If you've done like a whole week of exercise or something, get the family together and say, Oh, I've done this goal. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. One last thing. It's another day, by the way. One last thing, which just came to me now while editing this video is, if you want to stay consistent, don't compare yourself to others. Um, but look back on your results because that'll encourage you to keep going and just be patient. What's going on? Man, I haven't done that for a while, so I'm happy, sort of. Uh, it would have been nice to get 25, but uh, it's pretty good. The one was a little sketchy, 
still gonna take it though. Um, yeah, I think it's good every now and then just to pump out your max reps. Um, obviously it is for every set. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm wearing gloves now because I'm doing 20 minutes of pull-ups. So I'm just gonna keep doing as many as I can for 20 minutes. So I take a short break, then just get back into it, take a short break, get back into it. Um, I don't do, I used to do this every Friday and I stopped doing it, but I just felt like doing it again today. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do now. Pull-ups, take your breath away. You can see when I start to get tired and my legs come forward, I'm not sure what that is. Um, I, I really want to try fix that. I don't know if it's bad or anything, but um, yeah, if you know what that, why that happens, please let me know. If I'm supposed to like, I don't know, arch my back or something. Um, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of arguments for and against that. But uh, anyway, I must do another set. Okay. The key is to just take a short break and then when you feel like you're not ready, you just go again. Um, so I'm just walking around my pool. And then going back to the pull-up bar and doing another set. At the moment, I can only do six in a row. I'm, I'm 16 minutes in, nearly done. Let's do this. Just finished. Sorry about the wrong orientation. That is my bad. I don't know what I was thinking. It's because I don't have it on the tripod at the moment. I'm just holding my phone. Probably with all the working out, I just mixed it up. It's okay. Um, so what I was saying is, um, the whole point of this workout is just intensity. Just going to failure and going to failure and going to failure and minimal rest time. As minimal rest time as possible. Um, so I encourage you, try it out. You can go for 20 minutes, you can go 30 minutes, 10 minutes, five minutes whatever you feel like doing uh, or whatever you think you're capable of doing um, try it out just pull ups you can do anything push ups whatever skipping um, but yeah and uh, some things in the fitness industry that you want to take into account is if you're trying to build muscle or lose weight intensity is key and um, going to failure which is basically the same as intensity but yeah Keep in mind those two things and um i'm not i'm not calling you a loser it's, it's those two things uh, sorry that is a, a dad joke um also if you're trying to gain muscle then you want to focus on your protein intake getting enough protein and um, getting enough food in general and then if you are trying to lose some weight you want to get a calorie deficit still maintaining good protein intake though um but yeah hope you guys had a good time with me just randomly walking around my backyard um with the wrong orientation sorry once again but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you for watching and i'll see you soon peace